students this problem is related to ionic product of water i will read the question for you at 100 degrees celsius the ionic product of water is 55 times the value at 25 degrees celsius what will be the ph of neutral solution option a 7 option b 7.87 option c 5.13 and option d 6.13 students i will tell you what is ionic product of water then I will tell you for neutral solution what is the pH and how to find the pH and then we will move on to this problem. Ionic product of water is represented by Kw and ionic product of water is the product of H plus ions and OH minus ions. At 25 degrees Celsius ionic product of water is equal to 10 raised to minus 14. We define a quantity called as pKw. PKW is given by the expression minus log of KW that is equal to minus log of 10 raised to minus 14. It is of the form A raised to X that is log of A raised to X is X log A. So it will be minus of minus 14 log 10 log 10 is 1 hence PKW is equal to 14. So PKW is equal to 14 at 25 degrees Celsius and for neutral solution pH is equal to 7. If you carefully examine it clearly indicates that pH for neutral solution is half the value of PKW. So guys to solve this problem we need to find the PKW at 100 degrees Celsius and then half of that value gives you the value for neutrality. Is when you increase the temperature the ionization of water increases as a result the H plus ion concentration and the OH minus ion concentration also increases as a result the Kw value also increases hence at 100 degrees Celsius the Kw of water is 55 times the value at 25 degrees Celsius that is I can write at 100 degrees Celsius Kw is equal to at 100 degrees Celsius Kw is equal to 55 times the value at 25 degrees Celsius that is 55 into 10 raised to minus 14. If I calculate the value for if I find the Pkw for this Pkw will be equal to minus log of 55 into 10 raised to minus 14 it will be 55 into 10 raised to minus 14 that is it is of the form log of a into b log of a into b is equal to log of a plus log of b so hence it becomes minus outside i will keep outside log of 55 plus log of 10 raised to minus 14 it is of the form a raised to x again minus a raised to log of a raised to x is x into log a so this is equal to minus outside log of 55 log of 55 is given in the expression in the question Hence, it will be 1.74. Log of 10 raised to minus 14 is minus 14 log 10. And students, you know that log 10 is equal to 1. Hence, it becomes minus 14. If I take negative sign inside, it will be minus 1.7 plus 14. So, if we calculate it, the value will be equal to 12.7. 6. So this is pKw at 100 degrees Celsius and for neutral solution pH will be equal to half of this that is for neutral solution so pH should be equal to 6.13 and students option D is the right answer. Friends, this question is related to the POH of a solution. I will read the question for you. The POH of 0 0.0005 molar H2SO4 is option A 5, option B 3, option C 11 and option D 12. H2SO4 is given and they have asked us to calculate POH of a solution. So using H2SO4 you can calculate pH of a solution and then by using the formula pH plus POH is equal to 14 we can calculate POH of a solution. H2SO4 is a strong acid hence 
H plus ion concentration is equal to the concentration of the acid that is given to you because H2SO4 is a strong acid and it dissociates completely. But when H2SO4 dissociates, it gives two H plus ions. I will write the equation for you. H2SO4 undergoes when it dissociates, it gives two H plus ions and one sulfate ion. That is, if you take one molar H2SO4 solution, you will get two molar H plus ions. Hence, in this problem, guys, 0 0.005 molar H2SO4 is given. Hence, H plus ion concentration is equal to 2 into 0 0.0005 molar. Why I am writing directly is equal to concentration because H2SO4 is a strong acid. If a weak acid or a weak base is given to you, then H plus ion is not equal to the concentration. In such cases, we need to determine the H plus ion concentration by using the formula C alpha or root of Ka into C. So H plus ion concentration is equal to 2 into 0 0.0005. I will write this as 2 into 5 into 10 raised to minus 4. I have shifted the point. So this becomes equal to 10 into 10 raised to minus 4 that will be equal to 10 raised to minus 3 molar. Okay. Using this I can calculate pH of a solution. So pH is equal to minus log of H plus ion concentration that is equal to minus log of 10 raised to minus 3. This is of the form A raised to X log of a raised to x is x into log a therefore it becomes minus of minus 3 log 10 students you are aware that log 10 is equal to 1 hence the ph is equal to 3 but they have asked us to calculate poh of a solution you know the relation ph plus poh is equal to 14 therefore poh is equal to 14 minus ph that is 14 minus 3 that will be equal to 11. Hence, option C is the right answer. Friends, this is a problem related to calculating the pH of a solution. I will read the problem for you. The dissociation constant of a weak base is 1 into 10 raised to minus 5 at 25 degrees Celsius. The pH of its 0 0.1 molar solution at the same temperature will be option A 11, option B 3, option C 6, option D 13. Okay, before starting the problem, I will tell you what we mean by dissociation constant. Dissociation constant is a measure of strength of weak acid or a weak base. Larger the value of dissociation constant, stronger will be the acid or a base. If dissociation constant for an acid is given, is denoted by Ka and a dissociation constant for a base is given by Kb. You can look at the questions students. They have given a weak base and they have asked us to calculate pH of a solution. If a weak base is given to you, then the OH minus ion concentration will not be equal to the concentration that is given because the weak base doesn't dissociate completely as a result they will not produce the OH minus ion equal to its concentration. In such cases the OH minus ion concentration should be calculated by using the formula either H plus I, OH minus ion concentration is equal to C alpha where C is the concentration and alpha is the degree of dissociation or you can use the formula root of Kb into C. Since it is a weak base I can find the OH minus ion concentration and OH minus ion concentration is equal to root of Kb into C Why? because dissociation constant Kb is given. If a degree of dissociation alpha was given then OH minus ion concentration would have been OH minus ion is equal to C alpha but dissociation constant is given hence OH minus ion concentration is equal to root of Kb into C that will be equal to root of 1 into 10 raised to minus 5 and C is the concentration that is 0 0.1. So this will be equal to 1 into 10 raised to minus 6 root of 1 into 10 raised to minus 6 will be 10 raised to minus 3. So this is the OH minus ion concentration. Students you know that POH is given by the equation POH is equal to minus log of OH minus ion concentration 
and the OH minus ion concentration is 0 0.10 sorry 10 raised to minus 3 mole per liter hence POH is equal to minus log of 10 raised to minus 3. This is of the form A raised to x and log of A raised to x is x log A that is minus of minus 3 log 10 that will be equal to 3 into log 10 students you are aware that log 10 is equal to 1 so POH is equal to 3. But they have not asked us to calculate POH of the solution they have asked us to calculate the pH hence we know that pH plus POH is equal to 14 therefore pH is equal to 14 minus POH that is 14 minus 3 that will be equal to 11. Hence option A is the right answer.